Hey, hey guys. Man, dude. Let me tell you something. Whew. Well, first of all, welcome everybody. This is uh, my classic barbarian. Okay, he's level 83. Alright. Also, I have a hardcore classic barbarian that's 64. Okay. Um, as you can see, I play all over the place, you know. I've got some other ladder characters here. Uh, whatever. Just, just showing my account here for a minute. That was, that was last. Got to 96 there. But anyway, the video's about this guy here. Okay. Let's go ahead and make a game. Make it in hell. Well, let me think about it. Yeah, let's make it in hell. Why not? So, here in Classic, things are done differently. Okay? Now, I made a video on a Classic character a while back. It was my Fist of Heaven's Paladin. Okay? But I realized really fast that a Barbarian is more better of a way to go here if you're going to be playing alone. Okay? Because you can get down there really fast and all this kind of stuff. You can get down there with a Paladin too, but it's just, I don't know. I, the Barbarian just seems to suit Classic better to me without a team, you know, because my team ain't over here and all that kind of stuff. It's just something I decided to do. Now, <laughs> I've kind of got myself, I'm trying to map items to get better stuff, you know, over here and stuff. So, you know, I'll show you my gear. Now, now, don't get me wrong, I got a lot better gear than this on some mules, but I took it off right now to get my MF higher. So, weapon. This is actually a decent weapon over here. It ain't the greatest, but it's decent. Okay, armor. Again, just decent. It ain't even that good, but it's decent. It gets the job done. Okay. Now, I do have this helm here. This is more of what you're looking for, stuff like this right here, but like I said, MF, okay? Now, this, this ammo is pretty decent now. That's a good ammo right there. That's what you're looking for, stuff like that. Okay, that's just a typical MF ring. Typical MF ring. MF belt, obviously. Not very good MF boots, but there they are. Okay. Now, right before I kill the boss, I'll go ahead and stick this ammo on to get a little bit more MF. Okay. Now, usually what I do, and that's the same with these rings, because I'll stick one ring on. Okay. Now, you, I can stick them both on and have even better survivability. Actually, let's put that one on there. Okay. So, and then when you get to Diablo, you, obviously, you put this in that spot. You know what I mean? So, and this, this and that. But with my MF on and everything on, I have... 200 which over here 200 is ideal i mean that's you know because look if you get higher than 200 either you're rich where you can socket your armor and socket your helm and all that stuff either you're rich or you're weak as you can be okay so it's your choice well it's not really your choice it's luck it might have something to do with you being rich but you know what i'm saying all right man the build for me obviously one 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 this is to lower the defense if i want to okay uh i put a couple of skills here max the battle order out of course and then one skill here because this is your most important one they're all important but that's your most important i put a few here to get you know because you got a two-handed weapon you better put some skills right here okay max this out to get more damage of course Max this out. Okay. And then one and all of these. I think I might have put a couple here. Yeah, I put a couple here too. And the reason why that is because when you, you're in there and you run across that immunity to physical, you better have something or you're just going to have to leave the game and then you better want that whole run. You don't get Diablo or nothing. All right. And then, of course, stats, you know, and have to get your, well, you want to put a little more in strength when you're over here because it gets that damage up right there. Okay, and then everything else here. I actually put a significant amount here, and I put a little bit of dex here to get this even higher a little bit, and then everything else went into life, okay? And obviously, the, the thing that I was showing you back here, this, having a two-handed weapon in your hand, takes care of a lot of this right here that you're not going to have, okay? 
Okay, when I'm gonna bow, I'll put two to barbarian skills. Whoops. Two to barbarian skills. Okay. And then I have also have an extra skill here. Get that nice fat bow. Put these back. Put on your jump. That's how we do it here, guys. It's classic. Jump yourself down here. This is why the Barbarian for this run, among other reasons, is better than a Paladin or Amazon or whatever. Because you can get down here. All of the characters I feel should have had a mobility skill of jump or a charge, but charge where you could charge through the enemy. You know what I mean? Instead of just charge hit an enemy, you could actually charge through the enemy. Like, they could have it either way. If you reach, like World One, if you reach past, you spin through. Well, if you reach past... Hold on, I gotta go fix my weapon before we do this run. That's another thing I don't like over here. Repairing the weapon constantly. It's it, extreme annoyance. Anyway, I can see why they did away with with, with it being so often. Um, like I was saying, you could you could make charge like if you if you put your your attack on a monster, whether it be through some other monsters or not, it would charge to that monster and go through those monsters if, if the paladin had a charge like that, he could charge down here real fast, but he don't. That could have been something they done for him. The Amazon could have had something like, something almost like the Barb has, like a jump. You know, they should have gave her a jump too. Um, who else? Sorceress has teleport. Barbarian has leap. Who's left? I'm missing somebody. Barb. Amazon. The Necro. The Necro could have had something like. A bone that he could put down that would that would do a bridge where he could just walk over the bridge and walk over the monster, something like that, you know, something where he could also get around easier than he can do. Like, like if you're down Andrew and you're trying to find her, you could shoot bone, you know, shoot bone, walk over, shoot bone, walk over, shoot bone, walk over. That would have been so cool if they had all had some kind of ability. Then Enigma wouldn't be what it is right now, guys. I just rebowed like a retard. You believe that? I do need to rebow, but not right there. <laughs> not with those weapons. Anyway, it's just something of that that they could have added to the game. I wish they would have done something like that. It would have been really cool. Especially for over here. My God, I'll tell you what. But still to this day, guys, they have not added mobility. All we have is Enigma, man. But, uh... Game's still fun as hell. I'm not. I'm not dogging the game, guys. I'm just saying it just would have been really nice. Some nice changes that could have could have happened that I would have appreciated. I'm sure, a lot of other people. I'm sure. You don't have to kill every monster in here, guys. I'm just. I'm. I do it because it's the way I play. I don't like leaving nothing because any one of these guys could drop something of use to me. You know, I'm not racing to 99 or nothing. So, you know. I'm gonna kill every little thing. But yeah, you don't have to. You can, you can pop these seals and mow these guys down and get Diablo out real quick, you know. Just depends on what you're what you're doing, you know, what's your focus. I've had builds that would come in. Now here we go. This is what I'm gonna show you right here. I'm glad this happened. Okay, see that monster immune to physical? This is why you have this. A Zerk, right here. You run into this problem. Look at that. Because if I couldn't kill him, I'd be stuck. I'd have to start the game over. So you need to have, if you're going to play over here, guys, you need to have at least some, at least one point into the berserk. Because if you don't, you're stuck. Perfect goal. Thank you. So that's the reason why we go ahead down there and grab that skill so you, you don't have to worry about stuff like that right there. Now let me tell you something about this part. See these guys? See these dudes standing? I go for them first. They're the ones cursing you, man. You don't want to spend the whole time killing the mob of monsters when you're getting cursed to death. I got one left I missed. I didn't see him. See? And they go down a ways once you get the cursed guys out of there. Look at this guy hiding back here because he wants to curse me when I'm fighting the guys that's going to come down right here. But that's that's how I do it, man. I go for the curse guys first. Get them out of your hair, out of your way. You know, when you're killing every little thing, you know, playing like I'm playing. 
Now, of course, you know, when I'm level like, I say 92, 93, yeah, I'm going to get Diablo out as fast as I can and mow him down because that's going to be your source of XP, really. These guys, when you get to that level, they're going to pay nothing. It ain't going to be worth your time unless you're a mapping. But by the, I would figure by the time you were 93, you're probably going to have pretty decent little gear where you ain't really got to worry about killing every little thing. You just hope Diablo drops you something good. Because if you're truly going for high level, you ain't got time to do this right here, what I'm doing here. Plus, you want to be in a full game, too. Yeah, you don't have time to do all this. Especially if you're not in a full game. Oh, God, good lord, yeah. But right now... I'm trying to get better gear. I'm not really going for a high level. I can care less at this point. Whatever. <clears throat> yeah, you gotta have at least one ring on because if you don't, you ain't gonna be getting no life or mana back and you've got to have it, man. You gotta have it or you're gonna die. Or use potions galore. <laughs> comes Diablo. Now here's where we switch our gear, guys. I don't, think I, I don't need a Rebo. I don't like that curse on my head, though. Now, I always run sideways when you first come up to him, like he just tried to get me right there. Let me see if I can show you again. Alright, see that thing he sprays right there? When you're first coming up on him, run diagonal. Okay, run right across right there because if you run straight toward him, you're going to eat that attack right there. But if you're kind of diagonal like this, look at that. I can get right up on him. And whenever you get inside, that curse has really got me. Now, let me get this curse off me. Yeah, you don't want that on you when you're fighting him. When you got this much MF gear on, you sure better get it off you. <laughs> Go to town, it just pops right off me. That's funny. Because it knew what I was going to do. It knew it. Might as well repair this since I'm right here. Yeah, that curse, dude, they put that on you because they know it's going to make him kill you a lot easier. Now, this is what I like to do. You can either reach behind him and spin through him, or you can actually click right on him. Keep that button held down. You ain't going to let go of your target that way, and then just mow, mow him through like that right there. There you go. But yeah, when I'm first walking over from popping that seal, he's gonna, the first thing he's gonna do is shoot that at you. When he does, follow that line right there. Just walk straight up that line, that thing will miss you right on him, bam, start hitting him just like that. That's what I've learned that works best for me, anyway. Oh, finally one of these. Let me tell you something about this Ami over here. For me, that's the first time I got it. I've done many, many countless runs. Finally got it, right there. And that's going to give me crazy attack rating now. I got the rings, just never had this. Never got it. I already have that. Anyways, guys, let me show you him in some other, a couple other spots real fast. Okay, so let's just say you 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 didn't want to do chaos runs right now, and you want to do torrential. Now, now granted, my uh, fire resistance is low. I got to have on at least one of these, no matter what I do. Actually, let me sell that I'm kind of low on gold right now. Am I? Yeah, I'm low on gold. Better do something. Keeping that. Alright. So, fire resist is 44. It's not terribly horrible or nothing, but not ideal for this spot, I'll tell you that. Okay. Come on now. You don't really, right here, you don't really have to do the big bow I'm doing, but whatever. If you got it, you might as well use it. You don't have to, though. Alright. I got my MF ring on. Okay, I got my MF stuff on. Alright. That's what my bow was last. Yeah, just come in here and do this right here, you know. Your lance should keep you alive. Of course, once I get cursed, I'm going to be hurting a little bit. I haven't got cursed yet. Which is amazing to me. I should have got cursed by now. Yeah, there's an axe that could be something. Boy, look at that fire tearing me when I'm not swinging. Now I'm cursed and my life is low. This is where you don't want to be. <laughs> but we got him. 
I'll take care of them. Boy, being frozen seems like it helps you do more damage. Oh, weird. I, I don't think it does. It feels like it. Anyway, not much there this time around, but, you know, whatever. Let's see what we got. Let's see if that axe is anything at all worth of any value. You gotta get, like, 250 and up to get a weapon that actually has some damage. Which this definitely is not what you're looking for. <laughs> But like, you know, you look at my weapon right here, 267 damage, that's pretty good. Plus it has mana still, which even boosts its value up even more. But your ideal, what you're really looking for, is on top of what is on this weapon, also a uh, requirements drop. So you're not, you don't have to put that 169. Of course, you know, you're going to want some strength being one of these anyway. But if you can get one, with, you know, because when you're a lower level is what I'm saying. And you want to put it on. Requirement drop would help. Life on hit would help. I don't know if this can have dual lynch. I'm not sure if it can have dual lynch or not, guys. I'm not really sure. But anyway, that's a keeper. Alright, guys, man. Hope you enjoyed the video. Classic Barbarian. At where I'm at right now, I'm level 83. Um, let, me, let, me, let me jump on the hardcore guy real fast. I'm going to show you him real quick. Just for a second. Now, he's a nightmare. He's not in hell yet. I don't want to bring him there until I feel comfortable getting him there. You know what I mean? Right now, I don't feel comfortable. I can do hell. I'm not going to do a sanctuary hell run right now. Hmm. So. But I've been in hell. I've done it. I haven't found a weapon with enough durability is my problem. See, I mean, I just did a little bit of stuff and my durability broke because the durability is only 25. That is, this is not what you're looking for, guys. Your durability needs to be 60, okay? And like I said, my items here are not that great. Matter of fact, look like I got some stuff off me. I must have been doing something else. Yeah, this would be songs. Sagons, whatever it's called. Here's an ammo that I'm going to go into soon. Why on earth would I put the lower? Yeah, I think I was just taking stuff off this guy. I was doing something else, so he's all messed up. But anyway, we're in Nightmare, so I can still show you. As long as I make sure my lynch is good. Ooh, that one was really damaged. Oh my goodness. I got room to get that stuff off me or no? Good. Okay, so I'm level 64. I'm way over leveled for this area. Don't get me wrong, what I'm saying. I just feel like my items aren't good enough to go to um, hell yet. I don't want to lose the character. So basically, it's kind of the same situation over there. I'm a little bit richer over there than I am over here. I don't even have boots on right now, but whatever. I'm just going to show you. Uh, decentable MF, you know. Weapons, decentable, but, it, but the durability is terrible. Craft gloves, decentable ring, MF. These would be something the same as this, you know, because you, if you get the gloves, you get 30 increased attack speed, life steal, and, and this, and then the boots get 50 MF. That's what I would normally have on him. I'm trying to remember what happened. I think I lost a hardcore character. Yeah, I lost a hardcore character that had the boots, so that's why they're gone. Anyway, regardless, we could still do this round, man. But, uh,. He was getting pretty close to being able to go to hell, but I'm just, I gotta get a weapon that can actually last. And it ain't so easy. You know? I've been to hell, I think I got all the way through it. But then I'm not really wanting to run chaos hell yet. I just don't feel like, like he's ready. And that's one thing about hardcore, man. You need to take the patience and the time to make sure you're ready. Because, you know, you, you do all, you put all this time in and all this stuff, and then you jump down into hell real quick and die. And then that's it. It's over. Well, I was close to leveling when I made this video, wasn't I? Let's see what... Get off of me. Because it's... Yeah, it's strength that I need. Yeah, my, my life is good enough. Okay. See, when you put strength, 
you're going to gain damage. So it's good to put strength. You know, you got to make sure your other stuff is took care of. But yeah, it's, it's good. Ooh. Yeah, got to get that maxed out. So that's the main priority right now. But, you know, before I go to hell, I'm going to have to have a lot different gear than what I have on right now. All this MF is going to have to be lowered down because in hell, MF is secondary. Survivability has becomes first. Damage second, MF third. When you're playing hardcore, that's how I do it. Priority, the most priority, honestly, is survivability. Second priority is DPS. Third priority is MF. And you better, you know, you better build your character and your items just like that right there. Because if you don't, you will die. And have patience. Wait till you can round the gear up however you get it, you know. I could sell something over on uh, Softcore. Maybe say JSP. I could sell something on Softcore that I am after. And then, you know, put JSP money into this guy. You know, whatever. However you want to do it. So far, I have not done anything like that. Everything I've mapped, I've actually mapped here. And the form gold that I do have, I got from here selling stuff. So, so far, I'm legit. I haven't done any, any cross trading at all. But I'm not finding what I need. So the thought in my mind is to maybe do it. I can find out to sell because I'm a nightmare with this guy. So I'm starting to think maybe I will go ahead for a little bit and maybe you know. Whatever. I'm not going to say what I'm going to do because I'm not really sure. But the more I play and the more I'm not finding what I need because I'm stuck in Nightmare because I don't want to risk my losing my board, I might do something like that. I don't know, though. I'm not saying I will. I'm trying to be legit with this guy. I'm, I want to see if I can do it, you know, without trading on Softcore or whatever and all that jazz and all that stuff. But let's see. Give it, I'm going to give it some more time before I go ahead and use the form gold or whatever. But my weapon's gonna break soon. You'll see. Boy, man, I wish that would have been boots. I need some boots. Bad. Ha! Huh. Okay. Might as well. <laughs> Lost just a hair of life, but I mean, the MF and resist was worth it. He didn't shoot at me. I don't believe it actually ran at me. That don't happen very often. Usually, the first thing he does is shoot that beam at you. No boots. Come on, game. Seriously, man. What in the world? Anyway, this is my hardcore guy. I got the ammo for you on soft cores just a while ago. Not bad, actually. This is actually a pretty decent wand. Wow. 20 faster cast, one necker, good bone bone. Not not really what you really want, but I mean, if you ain't got nothing. Where the hell's my TPs? I'm out? Oh my god. Okay. Alright guys, man. Just wanted to make a video. I've made in, uh, many videos in a while. I don't feel good. I'm kind of sick. You know, I also made a video uh, displaying my ladder soft core guys man you know i'm gonna pick up making more videos just once i get through all this mess i'm going through i'm going through sickness one that first covid then the flu then uh strep that's what i have right now i'm kind of suffering from i've got taking these stupid antibiotics got over about to kill me and all this stuff you know so i'm going through a lot of stuff i got some personal business problems going on that i'm dealing with and just you know it it messes you up making videos when your life ain't straight. At least for me, it does. It's hard to. You're, it's hard when your life is not that great. You got problems going on in sickness, and then also to make videos every day. You know, I could do it, but the videos like this one right here, for instance, the quality is not that great. I'm not up to my spirits, and I know it. I apologize, but I got to give you guys something, man. I got to make sure that you know I'm still here. Things are gonna get better, and I'll start shooting videos out again as soon as things get better, man. You know, one thing about problems, guys, if, if you want to know, 
one thing about problems in your life nothing ever stays the same it always changes so one second you can be down in the dumps and have all kinds of stuff coming down on you and you gotta deal with it but it's not gonna be forever and then all of a sudden a new lights gonna open things are gonna get better you're gonna be happy for a while that's the way it is and right now I'm, you know, for the last couple months I've been on the downside so it'll get better anyway subscribe if you're not subscribed I really appreciate it um, I think I have 82 subscribers now. I appreciate every one of you. Thank you. Um, if things are going to get back to normal, we'll get to spitting them videos out again, guys. Oh, God. Logging out, man. You all have a good one. Exercise. Take care of yourself. See you in the next one.